Hi love bugs, it's me Bella. Um, it's been a hot minute since I've done a video, but I thought I had the perfect freaking story and uh, the opportunity to make a video and share it with you. So, really long story short, uh, the day before yesterday, I was in the house and I was cleaning and doing my thing or whatever the hell. And um, I had a pee, so I go to the bathroom and I didn't even bother turn on the light because I was by myself and I didn't bother closing the door either. <coughs> so, whatever, I sit on the toilet, I'm going to get ready to pee. And I look down and I see something by my foot. So I'm like, oh, okay, whatever, just pick it up. You know, no big deal. I thought it was like a rubber band or something. I don't know why, but I did. I reached over by my foot and I went to go pick it up and zzz, something fucking stung me. And I'm like, what the fuck? What the fuck is that shit? So I fucking jump up real quick, turn on the light. And I'm like, oh my God, it was a fucking scorpion. Okay, a fucking scorpion stung me. Oh my word. So I, I had that feeling like that, you know, when you hear like someone has lice and you're like, you know, you start scratching and stuff. I'm like, oh my God, like, oh my God. So I fucking run out in Chinga and I'm fucking freaking out. And so I call up the landlady and I'm like, oh my God, I think I got stung. I don't know if I got stung or not. And she's like, how do you not know if you got stung? I'm like, I don't know. I don't know if I got stung or not, but can you please send maintenance over here to coming to take it out of my house? Like, I don't want it here. So whatever, maintenance came and got it call up my friend Melissa and I'm like, Melissa, I don't know if I got stung or not. And she's like, well, bitch, you better go to the hospital because you don't know if it's deadly or not. I'm like, oh my God. So I was like, no, I think I'm okay. I think I'm okay. And sure enough, I start having a fucking panic attack. I can't breathe. And I'm like, babe, let me give you a call back. Okay. Like I, I, I need to calm down. So sure enough, I go outside and I'm, I'm trying to breathe and I'm trying to calm down and everything. And then like eight to 10 minutes later, I mean, I'm completely flushed. I'm bright red, bright red on my chest. I can't breathe, I'm hyperventilating. I'm like, fuck, I'm starting to feel weird. My fingers started to get really tingly because it stung me right between my pinky, okay? Like in the little web area, like right here. And um, sure enough, I call up my friend Nudie and I'm like, Nudie, oh my God, I got stung by a, a scorpion. Can you please? Um, well, I didn't know yet. I was like, I think I got stung by a scorpion. Can you please come pick me up and take me to the hospital? Like, I don't want to die. And and she's like, yeah, I'll be over there right now. So she leaves her kids and forgets her bra and comes here. And she she totally came with no, no freaking bra, poor thing. And she runs in the fucking house. And she's like, oh, my God, Bella, are you okay? And I'm, I'm, I'm fucking freaking out. So sure enough, whatever. We go to the hospital. By then, it's all in full effect. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm still freaking out. Now my fingers are tingly and my calf muscle on my leg is like doing this little fucking number, you know, and the back of my leg is hurting. I'm like, fuck, no idea. Like, I don't know what's going on with me. Like I'm freaking out. I don't, I don't know what to do. And I wasn't even like panic, but like panicking or anything. But, um, so sure enough, whatever, they're trying to control my breathing and they're taking my vitals and all that stuff. And they didn't want me to drink any water because yeah, something with like, they didn't want the venom to flush faster in my system. They wanted me to calm down because they didn't want it to, you know, take them full effect and whatever. Be what it may, they end up telling me, well, we don't have no anti-venom. I'm like, okay, so now what? Like, what? I'm going to, that's it? I'm going to fucking stay like this? I'm going to die or what? Well, the scorpions over here are not poisonous. They're venomous, but they're not poisonous. And I'm like, okay, so now what? Well, nothing. We just have to observe you because um, I guess depending on how your body takes to the venom, that's kind of what they go by. You know what I mean? Like if you have allergic reaction, well, they, they just treat you like if you're having an allergic reaction. That's kind of basically it. Well, I didn't. But I did have like full effect fucking side effects and stuff, you know. Um, but anyways, I ended up going home. And that whole freaking night, I mean, my my arm was all tingly. I couldn't feel my whole arm, first of all. Okay, I couldn't feel it. And my, my fingers were tingly. And, and it even moved on to this hand for a hot minute. And then it kind of went away. And then my leg was completely sore. It was killing me. It was hurting so bad. And then, um, sure enough, like today, because well, it takes like 24 to 72 hours for the whole like process to finish and to get out of your system. But this is how my hand is today. You see that? How like, and, and this is me like 
stretching it out like it's not going any more than this okay it causes like temporary paralysis i was stung in between oh i can't even move it right there in between there and it, it's like my hand is just it's all contorted i don't know what the fuck but anyways i have a picture of the scorpion because I was freaking out and I wanted to make sure that I had a picture of it. But let me show you what the fuck this motherfucker looked like. Can you believe that? Ah! Look at the tail, dude. It was ready to get me, motherfucker. Fucking hate scorpions, dude. Ooh, it makes me so mad. But anyways, um, it ended up being a fucking, uh, what is it called? Arizona bark fucking scorpion. But anyway, seriously, this can kill small children and fucking small dogs. Thank God I'm not a small child or a fucking small dog. But anyways, I just wanted to share that with you guys, but I'm okay, I'm alive, and I don't know. Let's see what happens at this point. Fact of the matter, do not pee in a fucking dark restroom. Turn on the light. Do not pick up shit off the floor unless you know full on what it is. Please, because let me tell you, it can't happen to you, okay? <laughs> Dumb things do happen to good people. I'm a very good person, but that was really fucking stupid, okay? But anyways, that's my story. Bye.